G'day power wallers. So, it's a bit of a warm one. That's sort of the ground at my feet, temperature wise. 38 in the sun up there. 39 on the gutter. So that gives us a good idea of um, how hot it was today. I think it was up to 42 in my shed today, but I didn't even walk out here. I opened the door. But batteries wise, I'll see if I can get the laser so you can see where it's pointing. You'd expect it to be a little bit hotter up this end because it's closed off a little bit. There we go. Well, at the end now, we go to the roof. Again, it's a bit cooler down near the door. We got uh, the fins. Oh, I can't even see. That's on the PCM 60X. 20, uh, 41 or 42 degrees. And as you expect, as you get lower in the shed, it gets cooler. Well, 37. So basically, all of those cells are the ambient air temperature. And although that's hot, it's not horribly hot. The cells themselves aren't hot to touch. You can hardly even see that, but that's wrong anyway. You got the battery, uh, the batteries are at 57.2 volts, so they're pretty much fully charged. Still charging at 10 amps since 4.30 in the afternoon. So, I wonder what this temperature is. This will be interesting. 45. Now that red has been running an, uh, an air conditioning air conditioning unit of about 800 watts for about six hours solid today. So she's gotten warm, it's not actually running at the moment. Load 800 watts, 700 watts. What have we got up here? So the battery voltage is 100%. And I finally got this sorted out. I um, I configured all my batteries to 400 amp hours. Isn't that interesting? 57.17 volts there. 57.3 volts there. And this one says it's 57.2. There's some accuracy for you. So, yeah, I, I've, um, before I got sidetracked, Pulling three amps from the batteries, so the rest is coming from the solar panels. 178 watts, pulled 0.4 of an amp hour, 100%. What was that one? That must be the hours left. But yeah, I got all that configured properly. Now, now it shows me the percentage and everything right. If I configured the battery bank at 400 amp hours. And that's um, the the high average is four point one or four point sorry it's four point zero five I've got to set up at the moment or something very close to that anyway. Um, I've just done all the battery voltages and even though this cell here and then that cell there was really low the other day, like a, a full full one volt lower when it was dead flat, they're both balanced out now and nearly all of the packs are within point zero four. Of a volt and that's every single one of them all 48 or 42 i tried to actually do a video of it but it's just ridiculous you just can't get the blooming multimeter and the everything in one view um if anybody saw my facebook thing the other day i was making a a manifold up here so i could run my cell log pro and then plug it all in so i could actually do a video but pff, that didn't work either so tubers and uh facebookers and power wallers Thank you very much. I'll see you on the next one. Hope that answers some questions.